many couples worry that uh, they have not yet conceived and they have not had a child yet and it's been more than 14 years of marriage they've tried the ivf treatments they've tried many many other treatments they want to think of going for surrogacy they want to uh, there are so many things that they've been doing in the medical sense you know to uh, see that they're ready to have a child to conceive and uh, you know but it's just not working out so when they reach out to me in, in a very frustrated state of mind where their body's already gone through a lot and their mind also because body has gone through a lot because of all the treatments and the experiments that go on on the body mentally they are also pressurized because they're aging and they also have family pressures people are calling them and asking them why aren't you still having a child what is your problem and each one is telling you go for ayurvedic you go for allopathy you go for this treatment you go for that treatment and there are also some people who would say you know go to this uh, temple go to that temple finally they just come back and say you know i've tried everything uh, i've even gone to astrologers and they have said you have pitra dosh you have sarpa dosh you have this dosh that dosh so uh, when they reach out to me i'm amazed that they know quite a lot about the doshas and uh they are very very well versed about their chart and and then they've done remedies and they've done remedies in kshetras like you know powerful spiritual centers and still they've not seen results and that's when when they come to me uh, i i always tell them to go through a, a a set path okay one is treating the planets in the highest way because they are the ones who tell you whether you are eligible to have a child or not and then of course all the doshas have to be cleansed uh, there is no two ways about it uh you have a pitra dosh you need to address it but there is also one solution which you can try because it has worked as a miraculous remedy for many many clients and even the temple priest uh, was sharing that he has seen miracles himself uh, where clients have i mean not clients i would say for him it is the devotees of the temple you know have seen phenomenal results they have conceived and uh, they have delivered ch- the child and they have actually named the child after god also because of gratitude that they have so this is the same venugopala swami temple uh, where they do the uh, santana gopala mukundashtakam so where they say where they chant the mukundashtakam uh, shlokas the eight stanzas of bala mukunda krishna as a small baby and uh, they do it for 21 days in your name and star and they when they're doing it they actually hold the idol of krishna as a small baby in their hand and then they do the ritual and after doing this puja for 21 days the prasad is given to you which you can as couple uh, keep it with you and use it in the way you have been advised to and definitely you're sure to conceive and have a child so this is something that you i feel uh, as an option you should try because people have gone to garbarakshambiki a uh, temple in uh, tamil nadu they've come back to me and said still nothing has happened uh, they have uh, tried many other things uh, so i feel that you know in my experience of seeing so many people balamukundashtakam works wonders and santana gopala japa also works wonders because uh, irrespective of caste creed and uh, religion i have had people from various religions come to me for santana gopala japa for balamukundashtakam and and both have worked wonders so this is something that i feel that you should try before giving up your hope of having a child of your own so i once you do this definitely i know for sure that you will have positive outcome and excellent results uh, and i am very very happy to organize this for you if you are interested do reach out to me it, the balamukundashtaka puja for 21 days thank you so much namaste mm-hmm.